Hey there everyone, welcome back to the Alienware YouTube channel. I'm Umar Khan, your dashing favorite bearded Alienware employee. Uh, today, we are going to be going over something that was announced at CES. For those of you that didn't watch CES or look at Cliff Notes online, why wouldn't you? We're going over the Cabby Lake units that Alienware has recently released for all of the Alienware notebooks and for the Alienware Aurora desktop. Yes, that means there are seventh generation processors all of our systems. This means that you also get quad-core processors in all of our notebooks. Yes, Alienware 13, I see you in the corner all sad. You're getting quad-core as well. But you guys have heard enough of my tech talks on the Alienware notebooks and also on the Alienware Roar. So what are the differences now with the Cabby Lake units? Well, for the Alienware Aurora, you're able to overclock all four cores up to 4.4 gigahertz. You're also getting an Alienware Aurora motherboard that is based off of the Intel Z270 Express chipset. It can use DDR4 memory running at 2400 megahertz or 2667 megahertz as an upgrade. Now the Alienware notebooks using 7th generation Intel processors can get up to 4.4 gigahertz on a single core overclocking. They also can use DDR4 memory running at 2400 megahertz and upgrade options for 2667 megahertz. Now the notebooks are based off of two different chipsets. The Alienware 13 is based off of the mobile Intel HM175 chipset and for the 15 and 17 it's using the mobile Intel CM238 chipset. All Alienware notebooks are using the 7th generation processors are offered with solid state drive technology at the lowest configuration. No need to upgrade. We have the solid state technology experience covered. All Alienware notebooks are also equipped with killer wireless and killer wired technology. The wired Ethernet is now based off of killer's E2500 gigabit technology. All Alienware notebooks also come equipped with the Toby Aware software enabling added power and security features based on your presence. For those of you that want to learn more about Toby, check out my Toby series on the Alienware YouTube channel. And last but not least, the Alienware 13 is cheaper now. But Umar, why? How? It is now being offered with the NVIDIA GeForce GTX 1050 option and an option for the 1050 Ti, lowering the price down to $999. So there you guys have it. That is the product walkthrough of the Cabby Lake Alienware Aurora and the Alienware Notebooks. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel. Also, you can follow me on Twitter at aw underscore umar. And if you have any questions about Cabby Lake Alienware PC gaming, PC gaming hardware, comment in the comment section below and let me know what you guys want to talk about. Also, I will take requests for performance videos. You tell me what kind of games you want me to play and the system, and I will jot it down and see what I can get out to you. Thank you all for watching. Bye.